the way you critique a culture is you biopsy it. Yeah. So think of a doctor. Yeah. If you know they're worried that John, you have melanoma on your on your right arm or whatever, they go in with a scalpel and they're very careful. Yeah. They're not emotional or angry yeah. or fast. They're they're slow and cautious yeah. and gentle and careful, and they scrape off. They cut out a piece of yeah. what they fear may be cancerous, but they don't know. And they then take that piece and they stick it under a microscope yeah. in a clean environment and they look at it and they analyze it very carefully. What's in this? What does it carry? What antibodies? What pathogens? Is this a threat? Where mm. is this going? If we let this go, where will it take John's body? If we leave it alone, will it be okay or not? Mm. And they just analyze it and they discern, they discern where yeah. it comes from and where it's going. So I think we can do that. Like a lot of my uh, preaching will have a moment where I'll take a statement like genders between the ears, not mm -hmm. the legs, or take mm -hmm. a, a tweet from a celebrity or take a New York Times article or an op-ed position or a ideological position from the left or the right. And I don't have to yell about it. I yeah. don't have to scream at it. I don't have to even rail against it. I can just take that statement and kind of lovingly cut it out, put it under a microscope, hold yeah. it up to the light, 